Hey Artland, how's it going? So if you guys haven't seen the videos, there are a lot of cool things going around right now where zoos and aquariums are bringing some of the animals out and letting them walk around the enclosures and see some of the different animals in there. And one of the places that is doing a really awesome job is the Shed Aquarium, and they are walking around their little rockhopper penguin, Wellington, and showing him all the different animals. So I want to show you guys how to draw Wellington, the rockhopper penguin from the Shed Aquarium. Now, to start off with this, we're gonna begin with the eye. So starting right here, I'm just going to make a little oval shape for the eye. Then inside of here, I'm just going to add a little black dot for the pupil. Now I'm going to leave a little bit of space and kind of lined up with the eye, I'm going to draw a line that's just going to kind of curve out to here. And then I'm going to draw a line that's just going to kind of curve up and then it's going to come over to here. Then you just want to draw a line that goes in and then down to here to kind of make the top of the beak. Now, starting here, I'm going to draw a line that just kind of goes down. And then I'm just going to kind of bring it up to here to make the bottom of the beak. Now, starting here, we want to make the top of the head and they have like a really feathery head. So I'm going to start here at an angle and just draw a line that kind of goes out. And then I'm going to add some kind of like little kind of pointy spikes on here just to make it look like he's got a really feathery head. Now, rockhopper penguins are famous for having these really long yellow feathers on, above their eye. So I'm going to start here and I'm just going to draw a line that's just going to curve out to here. And then I'm going to make these really long kind of skinny little feather shapes onto here. And I'm just going to kind of bring these all along here. And then I'm going to bring it up to here and add a few little zigzags. And then I'm just going to kind of connect it right to there. Now, starting here, I'm just going to draw a line that goes down. And then I want to make the wing. So to draw the wing, I'm just going to draw a line that's just going to kind of go out. It's going to go down, and then it's just going to kind of curve up to here. Then I'm just going to draw a little line that just goes down. And then for their tail, I'm going to kind of do the same thing I did up here. You just start here and I'm just going to add a few little zigzag lines for the tail. Now we're going to jump up here and draw the front of his body. So I'm going to start here and I'm going to draw a line that kind of goes in. And then I'm just going to draw a line that just kind of goes out and then it's just going to curve down to here. Then right here, I'm going to draw a line that just goes down. It's going to kind of curve and then come back up here for his other wing. Then right here, I'm just going to draw a line that just connects to here. Next, we want to make his little feet. So to do this, I'm just going to draw a line that goes down and then it's going to come over. I'm going to make a little line that curves back. Then starting here, I'm going to draw another one that goes out and then curves back. And then one more that goes out and then it's just going to curve back and up. Then I'm going to draw a little line that goes down here. And then I'm going to do the same thing. Just draw a line that goes out and then kind of curves back. And we'll just do two on this side. Now for some little details on here. 
Starting right here, I'm going to draw a line that just kind of curves, and then it's just going to go down, and then it's just going to kind of curve around to here for his belly. And then right here, I'm going to draw this line up, and I'm just going to kind of curve it around and bring it right down to here. And then I'm going to do the same thing over here. And then right up here, I'm going to add a few more of these little feathers, and I'm going to kind of curve these up, and I'm just going to put a few on the side like that. And there you go. There is your drawing of Wellington, the rockhopper penguin from the Shedd Aquarium. I'm going to fast forward and start coloring this. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed.